Good morning. <clears throat> uh, I may have to stop saying good morning because people pop on, maybe read this anytime during the day, but most of the time, it's the only time I'm doing this is early in the morning. And I have something, you know, maybe to say. And uh, today it's maybe, uh, you know, it's about, uh, you know, some bad behavior. And, uh, oh, it just seems to be running rampant. Uh, not, not only am I not allowed to really share my thoughts on, you know, the goings-ons that's goings-ons, you know, politically uh, speaking, I uh, kind of have to go around the outside edges of these things. I can't even get into a taxi cab where someone is saying, well, my wife and my daughter, I'm so proud of them, they went down to that, to that uh, march, you know, the March for Women against Trump. And, uh, you know, and I'm not a Trump supporter. But all I did was say, oh, yeah, well, uh, that's really cool, you know. Um, you know, what, they're not accepting his presidency? And they said, nope, nope. And I just don't like people like that. And I said, well, grab people that grab pussies, people that talk like that. I just can't take that, he says. He, I just didn't like what came out of your mouth. You know, and I was, well, you know, anyways. You know, I was all my way home. I'm just glad I got home. When I got out of there, I kissed the ground. It's, that's bad behavior. This is this is crazy. Some crazy shit. Plus, you know, I was online, and last night there was some guy, you know, one of these rappers, a black man. I don't know who they are. Either. I don't know who these people are. But, you know, he was reporting on this rapper getting mad at one of his... Uh, male black fans at one of his concerts reaches up and pats him on the ass and he just quits whatever he's doing turns around and just berates this person you know if you touch my ass I'm gonna kick your ass you touch me one more time you know or ever again you know and it's like where's this coming from from some some spoof you know and so, you know, I wrote in, I said, you know, this is just bad behavior. I said, if this guy had his shit together, you know, if he, you know if having more secure in his sexuality, you know, then that could be like nothing, you know. But it takes the little air of sophistication. It takes a little bit of uh, intelligence. All right. And all of these places are missing this. Madonna, here's someone's icon, you know, here, here's one of your... You know what the what what the Bible and what people would call this is an icon, an icon, and then following these icons, you know, and you know, and I just see it as some devil worshiping piece of shit, you know. But my friends, if oh my God, I would probably not be allowed over for dinner, you know. They see this, oh God, you talk like that about her, but you know, I could talk shit about uh, what's that other woman's name, Cindy Lauper. Because they don't like her, you know, so we can talk shit about her. But, you know, I can't sing any of her songs in uh, karaoke. <sighs> oh, what tangled little world we get into. But what bad behavior. Bad behavior. Bowling up, talking about us women. Are you together? Are we together? No, you're separating. You're doing craziness. This is nuts. This is just nuts. And it's just a bad behavior all around. And, uh, you know, it goes to show how it worked out. It all start off, so he's push, touching someone's pussy or he's making fun of some retarded guy, you know. And I can't get a comedian to... What's the matter with comedians? Are they pundits now? Are they... Do they work for the government? You know? What happened to this? Where's the funny? You know? Goddamn. <sighs> I wanted to make fun of some cross-dressing people for a while. They're from some of my friends. Some of my friends politically incorrect, you know. I said, damn, I didn't get the memo on retarded either. Oh, don't say that. Shit, fire. You know, I teach art class, and this is how I talk in my art class. You know, and they, you know, it would be tough someone running around after me, cleaning up after me, you know, I, not only from the paint. Oh, do you see who that is? Be the change. Be the change. It's just crazy. Bad behavior. Last night in my art class, I had this group of old people, older people. Can't say old. I'm getting there. 
drunk elderly came into my into my class. They didn't have any drink in front of them or nothing, and then they're just acting a fool and just weren't ruining everything. I had like 25 people in the class, and they were up front. And I said, you know, you guys don't even have any drinks in front of you. Reacting like this. You know, and they're just giggling and everything. Totally freaked out my class. Bad behavior, these people. Grown up and had all kids of their own, maybe millions of them all around them. They said, well, we drank before we came. And I said, well, that's a no-no. You gotta, you come here to my class and you drink. And then you, ca then you catch a buzz. Don't, don't, this is crazy. And it would just, just upset the whole thing. I'm, you know, if I have to go through that a couple more times, I'm going to stop, I'm going to ban drinking in my art class. It just, just ruins it for everyone. But anyhow, it was about bad behavior. You know, and I'm going to speak. I forgive those people for the things I do. I do a lot. But anyways, I know what bad behavior is. And uh, it's a shame. It's a shame. These people, all they need to do is, cause they're observing that, that, that lower side of them. That's what it means to... That's your nourishment. Because they're all really mad, and they wake up mad. They're in the red... You know, uh, it's just that uh, it shows how consuming it is and how how hard it is to build the temple when you're just constantly at war. And this is the war that they speak of. It's and then if you can't have this peace in your mind, you're not going to have this peace outside of this world. You're just uh, just never going to have it. And so, so you know, these people like Madonna. And all these people that, you know, in their single eye and their, their care for the world, you know, it's, you know, some things have to keep on going. They love this. They love this. You know, even even in the book that God would write in there, some, in one of the myths that says something about uh, the, pro the prophets prophesize falsely and the priests rule by their means and the people love to have it so. But what will they do in the end thereof? So, you know, it's like the whole thing's all been rigged like this, you know, so that we're on this big puppet show. Like the world is a theater, they say we all have our our jobs to do. But, you know, you can get carried away in this theater world. If you think that way, it's you're not a, you don't like being in your own skin. You're always being something else or someone else following the way they are and never having your own mind or being able to make up your own mind and having to follow the crowd. And right now the crowd is just just developing or showing or it's this bad behavior. And it's about it's everywhere. And it's it's this beta conscious, beta the lowest level of consciousness. And it's being fed by this by all of our carnal minds that are, you know, aligning with it. Think about that. And you'll find that this whole little fiasco is actually meant to happen. If you know that there's all this Satan crap going on, then that's how you feed it. You've got to keep this anger and this fight and this war going on outside so that it's constantly going on inside these other people and the way you get out of that it's always been to sh learn to shut off from all this it doesn't mean take no thought or care about anything you care but you yourself if you want to help what you do is you have to go inside there and touch the, turn the switch on so that light comes through you you know and then you'll be able to notice all this stuff I mean I, I'm I got bad behavior you know, I'm hardly the priest, you know, God, think about that. I'm not going to compare myself to one of them. But, uh, but most people would, though. No. You know, it's, um, it's my free thinking and ability to do things, but the idea is I could get up there and pshew. I'm not going to be of this world. I'm gonna, not going to be of it. I'm not feeding into it. I'm recognizing it and I'm sharing it with you. 
So all you want to do is get out of it. Get the hell out of this place. Go upstairs. Get this this delta, this frequency tune-up. And uh, come back down. Come back down and fight the fight. Fight the good fights, you know. But when I'm in this world, you say, you got to be with this world, you know. i got to be like them. i got to be like that. When I'm with this group of people, then i got to be like them. You know, they won't let me. When I'm in this place over here, i got to be like them people. Well, they won't let me, you know. But every now and then, I get to be where I want to be, and then I get to be free. That's what all that means, you know. But you got to be smart. Well, anyways. Bad behavior. <whistles> you watch for that. You watch for that and see how it happens. Alright? So, best to you. I love you. And I'll chat with you soon. You know?